The gate in there was nothing but the sea of chaos. Then from the sea rose the titan gods. They were divine beings, blessed with three gifts. But of time, the titans formed matter to create the world. With matter, they created two races and blessed them each with one of their gifts. Matter, blessed with the gift of birth, was able to breed, but fated to die. They were the mortal race. Matter, blessed with the gift of immortality, would live forever, but never bear children. They were the immortal race. However, some matter was left in the void. Dark and intangible was unable to hold on to the third and final gift to be given. For this reason, this gift would soon be forgotten. That is until a horrible curse was wrought upon the mortal race, forever changing their fate, forever changing the path set by their creator. Monsters. This is, next up on Howler for an Hour, The Wizard and the Slug. This game is a bit odd. It is a platformer with a very odd personality and sense of humor, but obviously a lot of work was put into it as well. So let's check it out. We are this. We are Slug. This, I, I think that's what we are. We seem to be... I th I call it more of a slime, but you know, slugs are slimy, sure. Let's start a new game. Story mode. Story mode sounds good, yeah. Press the skip intro. No, you don't understand. That's not why I'm sorry. Oh. We have D-pad or stick? Okay. Up we go! Do I want to beat up the birds? Okay. Maybe. Or maybe I want to avoid the birds. Oh god. A game-based silkworm! Where am I going? I'm still technically controlling, but I don't have a lot of room to dodge, sadly. Thanks, guys. I'll get to that soon. Post-intro first, though. Act 1. The Passion. Achievement unlocked. Once upon a time. Oop. <laughs> Slug got woken up. It's like in his little cave. Hmm. We're awake! These eggs are unfertilized. Oh, we have eggs. I guess we're female? This is hardly proper ventilation. Uh, apparently not. Leave? Sure, why not? Not much to do in this cave. <laughs> Hello? It's a berry! Berry is harmless. Please don't hurt berry. Unless berry... Bad, bad berry. Um... Okay, don't, I won't hurt berry. I tried jumping on him. Since I can't do that, I won't hurt him. Wait, what the fuck? I'm sorry, what did I just do? Is that an attack? Oh no, I'm sorry, Barry. <laughs> I was confused. Sad, sad, Barry. I made Barry sad. <laughs> What's this? There appears to be a severed limb of some strange animal. There is no blood. Did the, slug, did the slug pick it up? Yeah, why not? Slug pick up the arm. Press back to... Okay. Open inventory. All right. Well, oh, what the hell is this? This is a weird inventory. Bounce shot. Same projectile that bounce on the ground. Walls knocks enemies back. Okay. 
Gift of Birth, the Mortal Curse. All right. I guess that's what we have. Severed Arm, where is the blood? Hmm. Let's talk to other berry. It's a berry, it's very cute. Is it? Sad, sad berry. I'm, I'm mean, I should not pick on berries. It's a berry, a good choice for mixed herbivore carnivore dinner parties. <laughs> it's a berry, or is it? It is! They each have their own dialogue. It's a berry, you name it, carry. I'll leave them alone. You attack by splitting yourself apart. Yeah, it looks like I just temporarily lose body mass to... I, I kind of like it, honestly. It's a good attack. Oh, oh, I can also use it to double jump. Ah, I'm so tiny. <laughs> ding, ding. Okay, one second. Let me... What are the berries doing? Boop. <laughs> All right, what, what is going to happen when I approach this character? We'll find out in just a moment because I have to pull out some buns from the oven, literally. <laughs> so one second. <laughs>
Excellent job. Your patience is commendable. I was also the fastest I've ever fixed a burger. <laughs> I was trying to hurry. Charm's gonna be confused as fuck when he gets back. What? <laughs> Do dittos enable the men to lay eggs? Oh. <laughs> well, at least you guys kept yourself entertained with uh, insightful conversation. Um, <clears throat> well. <laughs> uh, let's see. There is a Tucker readout message. Uh, okay. There's a slug on the ground. What they do? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Eggers instead of Pregers? I mean, well, if it's a Pokemon, I guess either works, right? Because <laughs> I guess that's the topic. So I got burgers and I got tater tots and let's, 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 and then after spending five minutes contemplating what to do with this situation, the slug, which possessed very few brain cells and thus needed much time to process this, decided to approach the berries. Some berries are watching curiously, but don't seem to be of much health. Goodbye. <laughs> Strange vibe part of an unknown animal. There's no blood. How curious. Wait, can I just go? <laughs> Wait, hold on a minute. Give me a sec. The slug turned back to investigate a strange person. I was wondering if I was just allowed to, allowed to leave for a second there. <laughs> okay, like switch abilities. All right. Have you come to end me for good? No. Not a religious nut job? No. All right. Great. Fantastic. <laughs> anyway, while we're on good terms, you think you'd do me a favor? You see, I seem to be missing some limbs. You know what they say, you mess with a bull, you lose an arm and a leg, or something like that. Well, I did. Now I'm all over the place as a result. You think you'd help me find them? Sure, I'm just a slug. Thanks, buddy, you're a real lifesaver. If you find anything, just bring it back here, okay? Alright, I will get... Oh, hey, that's... Oh no! No, it's fine. Listen, let's talk this out. Never mind, I'll just have to shoot you. Slug pick up the leg! There we go. You're a very bad berry. You know what that means? A bad, bad berry met some eyes. See what happens, Barry? Don't be bad, Barry! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> don't, don't steal limbs that aren't yours. Lesson to be learned, Barry. There we go. Ah, that's better. May not be mortal, but it still hurts, you know. Oh, it's uh, mortal. Okay. I'm Charmed, by the way. Just your friendly neighborhood wizard. Hey! It's my female form name. <laughs> Charm. Yes, yes, let's go with that. I'm a wizard, sure. That's not suspicious. To the debate whether or not you're a wizard. <laughs> or witch, if you prefer. Either one is fine, really. <laughs> anyway, don't worry about little old me. I'll be fine. I'm gonna buy a burger. One second. Delicious! Although, truth is good. I don't have many friends left in this world. My siblings are all gone missing, or worse yet, been locked up like I was until I managed to escape my prison. And even then, I couldn't do it alone. I needed to help someone else. Anyway, I will not forget this favor you did to me today. However, I'm afraid I have one more thing to ask of you. Do you by any chance own a history book? No? Want to be in one someday? Because I have to change this world, you know. And that's kind of hard to do on your own. <laughs> Will you join me? Sure, why not? Change of the world. Sounds like a thing a slug would do. That's a spirit. Kid, however, I do decide it's somewhat strong. So don't hold anything back. What? Oh, okay. Look, damage. Oh, shit. Oh, oh no, I'm a little guy. <laughs> so I can shoot multiple directions. Okay, I see. Plus your four, it's easier. So, do we have infinite health if we don't get hit twice in a row, maybe? Oh, I missed. That's why I got him. <laughs> yeah, that's the stuff. Hostess. What? I like you, kid. You got spunk. Hmm? What was that? You're not a kid. You're an adult. Hey, kid, when you're as old as me, everyone's a kid to you, all right? a bit scary, but he's still a bit cute. <laughs> Slightly smiling face. <laughs> it's a little bit scary, but still cute. Uh, fair enough. 
Now listen, I'm very old, so I have to take a power nap. Inside you. What? Wait, hold on. Don't worry, I'm not dirty. I wash my hands every time I go to the bathroom. Impressed? Well, I lied. I don't go to the bathroom! Anyhow, you don't mind, do you? Uh, sure. Go ahead, four time. Well, thanks. I'll just get comfy then. In the meantime, just keep hanging these for a while. Don't worry, I'll explain everything in due time. See you in a bit, buddy! Mystical Vor. <laughs> All right. <laughs> As a wizard's soul intertwines with the slug, it is gained is granted the divine gift of immortality. Not normally disposed of on any mortal, should the slug's body ever be destroyed, the gift will restore it at the last save point. Hey, how nice. What's this? It's a smoldering crator. Is that, that's not how you spell crator. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm digging this. This game has personality. I, I could tell from the trailer that it was something different, you know? Something that had a little bit of flair to it. Wait, I can trouble and triple jump? Oh, I can. <laughs> I can become a little pee. <laughs> I didn't realize I could trick smaller. Doesn't mean I can throw myself when I'm. <laughs> I can become so small! Look at this. It's <laughs> great. You can change your controls and. Uh, okay, yep. Woodlands. Okay. Those are safe points. So that berry. Berry, don't care. Berry, careful! Rip berry. Double jump again. Hit. Drain some extra salmon. We'll take longer to regrow. Look, listen for the regrow cues. I think I think we actually have infinite health if we don't fall apart. Can I destroy those? No. Wow, they both fucked up there. Basically, I think I can't... Probably I can't die unless... I'm assuming those are actually enemies. I assume we can only die if we, uh... Get hit while in P form, basically. Meaning that our attacks are a double... So basically we have three hit points, but our attacks and jumps cost us hit points. But we regenerate them, so, you know. I think that's how that works, anyways. Oh no, it's angry. These blocks were made for breaking. These shoes were made for walking. <laughs> what are these little things? Oh, even when I- oh, look at that! When I double jump, I'm, that actually counts as an attack as well. Oh god, exploding puppies. No, go away. Mushroom. Behold the fearsome mushroom, known, of course, for their incredibly strong exoskeleton. Try pushing it into spikes with your bolts, of course. Okay. Wow, that was fun. I'm glad I could randomly murder something for no reason. <laughs> I completely messed up their AI. You only lose health when hit while you are the smallest size. Okay, so there it is, right there. We do have hit points, but it only takes effect if we get hit while we're in the smallest size. Okay. So yeah, I kind of inferred that. Something like that, at least. So if we're careful, we can either be really aggressive or we can just be careful. You shoot up, but hold up and down. And down by holding down. Makes sense. Double jumping also shoots down, so that's technically a better jump, better way of doing Ooh, not. Ow. Oh no. These little guys are aggressive. But no, sir, I didn't actually take any hits because they kept hitting my second form. Hold the jump button, jump higher. Time is key to get the most high your double and triple jumps. That's fair. Hmm, dead end, huh? Fair not, kiddo. This is a job for the last race magic user. Hearts. Yeah, so they'll do. <laughs> there we go, some of my famous heartbreak platforms. Proving withstand the weight of the chinchilla. Impressed? That's it's not very heavy. 
Well, I lied. I don't, I don't know what a chinchilla is. No bad, terrible beast with a name like that though, right? <laughs> right, now. Now, for no reason in particular, how much do you say you wait, kid? What? Why are you giving me that look? I'm just... Alright, calm down. Don't do much... Just don't put too much weight on there, is all I'm saying. Got... Understand? <laughs> what exactly are you implying? You want to start cooking you. So jump on them while the size is smaller. I see. Hold the fire key to prevent growing. Oh! Hmm, that's handy. I can just remain this way. <laughs> forgotten shrine. Well, I, I just remember. Well, just right over here. It's not that forgotten then. No worship has taken place at this shrine for many years. It's overgrown plants. Will you pray? No, why not? Get a chance to eat a burger. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, please, don't bother yourself. What's the point of carrying on with those ancient traditions, hmm? Do you really believe this rock is of any help to you? It's not. It's just an old washed up relic from another time. When things are way more boring. I say smash these things into pieces and make something actually useful out of them. Like, a um, like, like a big old pile of rocks. Yeah, oh, that is be an improvement, that's for sure. Now, if you're not wasting your time, can we just go? All these places give me the creeps. Hmm, she doesn't like them. Hmm. Well, given that she's immortal, I would imagine she has a worship statue somewhere, right? Because she's kind of a god, I guess, right? I don't know. At least I would, I would think the mortals would think that way, but... There's a fit inscription. Inscription needs a P, but good work. Our Lord, born of the Sea of Chaos, mother of all, our life and death. Oh. Ah, much better, don't you agree? <laughs> hmm, you don't get it? It's art! You're not supposed to get it. So don't worry about it, kid, it's just art. You seem rather insistent to destroy that. <laughs> Achievement unlocked, art lover. It's art! <laughs> hey, we're a slug, we'll just believe it's art, sure. Apparently it's art! Cool. Hmm. It's my dark duplicate. Oh, ahem. Well, I'm not sure what will happen now, but I'll just give you two some privacy. Wink, wink, dodge, dodge. Are you insinuating something? Yes. <laughs> all right then. Oh, all right. I, I don't know why we're fighting an evil version of us, but okay. That was easy. <laughs> You got a piece of hope. Yay! Didn't know that was a tangible object. So, how'd it go? Hmm? Not one to cast and tell, eh? Me neither, but I don't really have any lips. <laughs> yeah, notice that. <laughs> she thinks we had the sex. <laughs> Hi, what's up? A berry waves at the slug. Wants to show something? What's up? We will follow. Oh, look at that. It's... <laughs> I love... Look at this bear. It's like, look at that guy right there! Isn't that great? <laughs> it's like... A <laughs> fucking face, man. <laughs> Just... Okay. This one doesn't seem very impressed. <laughs> Is this it? it? It wanted to show this? It's a bear with a weird face. I... All right, guys, should I attack the Elvis Berry or should I just move on? <laughs> what do you guys think? I might be forced to attack it, actually. No, it looks like it's letting me leave, actually. Kill him. Oh. Why is his face like that? It doesn't seem to do much else, it just has a weird face. Hmm. It seems happy. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> Okay, I don't- it's not gels or anything, it just- it doesn't mind weird face berry getting all the attention. It's a suit. it's a Soom berry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this dialogue is good. Is that it though? There's, that was it. There's nothing going on there. Alright, well, let me just push that. Oh, oh no. Oh no, it's showing tadpoles. Stop that. Okay. 
Alright, so, so I gotta stay small for these, you know? Alright, and sometimes bigger is better. It's true. Can I, uh... How am I gonna... I'm wondering how I'm gonna... Oh, there. Jump at the end. Why are they shooting Bambi? Because that's an attack method of a lot of enemies in video games, for some reason. It is really kind of common, though. Especially for frogs. See Mega Man 2! What's this? Oh, okay. Oh god. <laughs> I didn't hold down fire. <laughs> also, Zami, thank you for all the purchases lately. Look at this big old slime with the teeniest face. That's great. Oh god, they're rolling. That's less great. Oh, all right. All right, I'll let you commit the suicide then. Um, oh, yep, 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 yep. I know how this works. I confused it. Oh, tadpoles everywhere. Uh, hi? Hi, it's me, Banana Man! You're on an adventure, yes? Can I come, please? Sure, we can use a banana. But I just can't go on, can't, can't go on adventures, they're just food. Yeah, let's use it, we can use a banana. Oh boy, oh boy, I won't let you down. Nuh-uh, not me. I'll follow you to the ends of the earth. Get out and slug. Team up for the ages. Partners for life. Now look at him go. He's really, he's really putting all his all into this, isn't he? Alright, cool. <laughs> Comes here, our famous death pit. The one and only, only one in the world. No wondering. Is at your own risk? Hey, you can do a jump, right? Yeah, that's so. <laughs> hey, you okay down there? Okay. <laughs> Living! <laughs> I got the eliminated treatment. I had it, I wanted to check on him. The banana partnership ended very too soon. Way too soon. It's a shame. Because we all know banana slugs are an actual thing. If you didn't know, they are. It's just a shame. Oh, hello there, little one. Come closer, won't you? Uh... Cave entrance. Hello? A bit closer still. My eyes are not what you used to be. Okay. Why aren't you a sweet one? Thankfully, my taste buds are not with it at all. Uh. No. Okay, fine. No. Oh. oh, thanks. It's like, but you know what? Sure, I'll do the vor. <laughs> what? Not your kind of snack? Well, it's an acquired taste. It's a confusion. Oh, what's this? A mischievous fairy. <laughs> Wizard is fine. Yeah, I think we've settled for that one. Oh, I know who you are. I've heard about you. I've heard about what you did. Mother's whispers reach f reaches far. Whispers, rumors of calamity. I've heard them all. Flattery words, I'm sure. And what are, what are you then? One of her pawns, I presume. Of course, I get it now. That big fat mouth of yours must sure must be handy for spouting her nonsense. I serve no one. Her matters mean little to me. But make no mistake, neither does yours, wizard. Although without the curse, I would have never known the taste of my fellow kin. And what would I do then? I'd lose my biggest passion. 
Now each fight fills me with such joy. Perhaps I should thank you, wizard. Great, so we can pass through? Sure, just offer me your pet and I'll let you through that coral. Let's say you, wizard, do we have a deal? Hmm, nah, no deal. Then I shall revel in seeing your remains of my excrement. <laughs> hey kid, this creek got nothing on us. If he tries to suck you in, just run the other way, okay? Got your back, so don't even worry. All right. Chrysote? What, what? Is he based on something? All right. Oh, shit. Oh god, those hurt you too. Okay, I guess that kind of makes sense. Oh, I see the attack also hurts him, which is good. Yeah, that makes sense. Finish him! There it is. <laughs> ah! Forgive me, my lord! Mother of all my life and death! It seemed to just hurt me, by the way, when I did the vor. I swear my next life shall be a righteous one. My sin's undone. With earth, I'm one! Release! Me! <laughs> I see. Pathetic, no? In life, they don't care about sin. The last living moments, that's when they tr they turn to their gods. What a joke. I hope that Korean reincarnates into a crab. That's not what you are, right? A crab? No? Okay, good. I didn't mean to offend. Honestly, I don't know much about world races. There are so many of you. All different kinds. Not at all like the immortals. I know about crabs, though, I think. Or was it clams? Whatever. Cats? I don't know. You're all right, though, buddy. Whatever you are. Not a crab, right? Yeah, okay. Just checking. Uh, hmm? What's that? What did I hesitate back there? Did I actually consider something out just to pass through? Of course not. That's just your imagination, Ray Wild. Come on, have some faith in me, kid. I mean, we've known each other for a few months now, by now, haven't we? Or is it minutes? Months or minutes? It, it all blends together when you're old like me, kid. Still, there's one thing I've learned about time is that it shouldn't be wasted. So let's continue, alright? <laughs> Spread shot. Effective ability of large groups of weaker enemies. Up close is also significant damage, jailer. A slug shotgun. Switch your attack with Y. Uh, we're not, we're blue. So with that normal shot, green. This shot, yeah. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it so much, I'll take a bite of my burger. Hmm. Good. All right. <laughs> Day passage. Hi. Oh, you just okay. <laughs> I see. Almost. Okay, fine. I guess I'll just have to rush through. They're honestly a bit slow. I don't know why I'm so concerned. Oh God, bats! <laughs> Yeah, so my this shot does more damage though, so I might stick to it. Also, it bounces. Well, that makes them angry. Also, I like the music so far in this game. It's good stuff. Also, charges you outer heart. What does? No. Go away. <laughs> Go away, bat. The so, hordes of enemies, yeah. Spread is kind of useful for actually getting hits. Especially with smaller enemies. Hmm. That worked out. <laughs> hmm, two paths. Is 
So for not really. There we go. <laughs> what the hell? Not all weapons work on all enemies, so remember to switch it up. You mean like, is this too weak an attack? Oh, I see. So yeah, it's too weak an attack, so I gotta use the heavy shots of this guy. I get it. Makes sense. Oh, he bounces my shots around. Okay, well. These bounce, these bats bounce really unpredictably, as demonstrated. Oh, I finally took an actual hit. So if you're wondering how many hit points I have, I have two, I guess. Cat. Konnichiwa, I'm a Japanese cat, nya. What is my name, nya? It's Adaku Tetsu! Nah. What is Japan, yeah? It's my own made-up country where all dreams come true, yeah. It's my own scene, yeah. That's original country, yeah. Do not steal. Make up your own country. I'll give you constructive criticism. I have many much experience making up countries, yeah. Say, stranger, are you a Neko person or an Inyo person, yeah? Um, and you. You filthy dog! You dare insult me to my face, yo! Well, dogs are better. Let's go. Oh, he's actually kind of fast. I'm gonna keep it up. <laughs> Too bad he bu buckles into my own, my attacks every time. B Bahada, you beat me so easily. How shameful, Hazukashi Na. What are you doing, ya? Tots are encouraged. Uh, encouraged, nah, because dogs are not evil. Really? You think I have potential, nya? You'll teach me. I'll work hard to improve. You are my sensei, nya, nya. This is how it should be. Cat is... Dog is sensei to cat. Or... Yeah. It's like that. Alright, there we go. <laughs> Master Disciple achievement unlocked. This is how you do it. Dog superior are proven. Oh god, watch out. We have a friend. I wonder how long he'll take before he falls down a pit. Hmm. I'm sorry about the water. I know you hate it. Oh god, somebody, somebody, uh oh. Get him! <laughs> Just shake a bitch! The music did change because I have cat. The cat one shot the big Lizzie? Oh, I guess the big Lizzie is weak to Dagger. To be fair, Dagger probably does more damage than Slime Shot. Yes, the music did change to what we have here. Hmm. Oh no. It's fine, I'll, I'll be fine. Take that. Oh, that's a lot of ink. Caution, wet floor! <laughs> yeah, I kind of noticed that. Go, go! I want to see this one shot. Okay, well, we'll have to deal with the bats first, but... <laughs> he really wants it. <laughs> okay, yeah, he does a one shot, but you can see his damage numbers. He does quite a... He does only one... He only occasionally does two damage, but he does multi-hits, so... No way! Marin did now! I hate water! There's only so far I'll go, even for Sinsen, yeah. Also, it's getting late. Akasan, ok it's worried, yeah. I'm going home now. I'm only four months old, yeah. It's past several of my bedtimes, yeah. Sensei. Come on, come on now. Let's train again tomorrow, yeah. Bye. <laughs> hey, was that a crab? No? Well, never mind then. <laughs> She's just trying to figure out what a crab is. I'm sorry, what was that? What do you mean, who am I? What? No, I'm Charm, remember? The wizard. You were joking? Yeah, I knew that. I was just hearing because you're my friend. That's what friends do, they hear each other's jokes. Even when they're terrible, like yours. 
Hey, I'm just joking around. Relax, buddy. Now, it looks like we're going for a dive, kid. I hope you can hold your breath. Did you know us wizards can hold our breath for 10 minutes? Impressed? Well, I lied. I don't have any lungs! What about you, kid? Got any lungs? Hmm. Lungs and gills, you say? Well, is that convenient? Multitask. Multitasking on breathing. I know a little bit of the weeb speak. Weep cat, weep cat was cute. <laughs> hmm. And down we go. Underwater passage. Okay. Like gameplay wise, it's a little bit simple, but it's really got the personality and the writing, and I think that's, you know, that may more than. It's more than a, uh, more than good when you have writing this this quality, and also the gameplay is fine. It's just I wouldn't call it the most complex thing ever, but it really does work. I trying to trying to ricochet it. It's not it's not doing. All right, fine. There we go. Ooh, almost touched the spike. Be careful. I guess I don't really need to kill everything, huh? Frogs are dangerous, though. They need to go. Octopi are dangerous, too. Get out of here. <laughs> Aragon screamed again. I can't hear behind my headphones, so that's interesting. <laughs> I am amazed that none of that hit him. Excuse me. It's probably easier if I was smaller, but eh. I'm too pro for that to matter. Five eggs too much for it to be I don't see why not. Eggs are good. Oh no, I found a little tadpole. I didn't even see that. Frogs are stupid. Get out of here, frogs. Hideout! Recruits wanted. Before heading down this pit, consider joining a revolution. Please apply here. Uh... Uh... Do I go down or do I go right? I'm confused. It says before heading down this pit. Consider... Okay, so it's before heading down. Alright, sure. Let's go over here. Secret hideout. Not very secret when you put up a sign. Main objective. Find recruits. <laughs> Step one. Find recruits. Step two. Backstabs. Step three. Topple regime. <laughs> What to put in this space? Stop posting this. But as situation. Let's eat them. Good idea. Thanks. <laughs> Who drew this? Is that like a bunny in a... In, 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 a, in a... In a bikini? <laughs> New uniform must be intimidating, eye-catching, and fabulous. Too cute? Maybe add a cool skull? Hmm. After work suggestions. <laughs> Wait, the Cat King, our target. After work suggestions. Orgy? No. Why? Let's just get drinks. <laughs> After work suggestion. That's the first suggestion, huh? <laughs> All right. Looking for Mr. Mike? Call for ha casual hookup. Not here. All right. <laughs> so what? Then I say, don't worry, baby. That ain't whip fluid. Shh, wait. I hear the boss coming. Don't look busy. It's, it's another cat. <laughs> hey, Necklads, why are you not in your uniforms? Well, look, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. The uniforms suck. <laughs> ah, not this again. Well, I think they're good. <laughs> no, you don't. You said they make you all itchy. I do have a sense of skin, yes. 
So this is why you never do design by committee. Everyone just had to try it about design, now no one's happy. But now these are the only these are the only uniforms we have now, so suck it up and start wearing them, alright? Yes, boss. But what no, that settled it. Next up, we have to sign on a strong name for our rebel group. Any suggestions? Oh, I have a suggestion about No, no more suggestions! I'll just sign a name, alright? Democracy is a flawed system, comrade. Hold on, who's that over there? Is that a new recruit? Hi. Uh, yeah, boss, that's it. This new recruit brought you. Yeah, through hard work. Excellent. I'll make sure to double your pay this week. But you don't pay us anything. Hey, Slug Boy! Come enjoy the rakes, have you? Slug Boy? What if it's a girl? We did have eggs. That, however, does not confirm or deny our gender. Huh? Like, what if it's a girl slug? Well, it's obviously a boy. Look at it. Boss, it's rude to look that closely. She's talking about the horns, you idiot. The horns. I thought they were arms. <laughs> horns? I thought those were his wavy little arms. Exactly. Don't you fools learn anything at school? Everyone knows only boy slugs have lump antennas. What? You're making that up. I'm not. Now, what's it gonna be, stranger? Uh, what's it gonna be, guys? Ellipses are joining. Joining the cat and her two dust mites. I, I don't... What is, what is this gang? <laughs> okay, join, sure. Great, you're hired, rookie. I'll help you fare better than the last recruit these buffoons brought me. Come on, what was wrong with the last one? Oh, hey, he's fine. New recruit banana man reported in. I'm in charge of the food around here. You're not in charge of the food, you are the food. For today's special, we have dirt and water! A favor from the old country, guaranteed to keep those leaves lush and green. Why are you cooking it? <laughs> we need, really need to patch up that death pit. We just keep falling down. Anyway, rookie, allow us to make a proper introduction. So, guys, have you all practiced our introduction speech? Just give me the script, all right? Don't mess it up. Yeah, don't mess it up, dum dum. Shut up. You always skip practice. Practice for nerds like you. Uh, shut up, nerds. Let's go already. Ahem. We're the terror of the status quo. Turn on us, and we'll be your woe. We'll sneak into your bed at night. I stab you in the back! That's right! Meowth, that's right. <laughs> we are the... Dust... Might... Our... The Might Dust Might Mate... Dust Might Gang of Victoria Free of Fighters! Don't forget our name! <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Of Extraordinary Freedom Fighters! Oh, I see. <laughs> Doesn't quite roll off the tongue, does it? <laughs> Let's hear your suggestion, then. How about the Team Dust Might? Something to the point, unlike your word salad. Stop it! Why don't we even rehearse this stuff? What did I just tell you? So no more suggestions! Ah, forget about the name. Let's just move on to the admission exam. Rookie, it's time to free yourself. Seize your challenge! Uh, ring of combat, boring. Slime volleyball, heck yeah. Uh, what do you guys want? <laughs> I guess we have a choice. So you guys want volleyball or you want a fightings? <laughs> the game, I like how the game is commenting on which one's better. <laughs> that kind of game's like, but you should pick that. Heck yeah! <laughs> Alright, slight volleyball then. Challenge accepted! Alright, how do we play? We couldn't afford a net, so we'll just use these cardboard boxes. Alright. What do I have to play? This is gym class all over! Also, we couldn't afford a ball, so we'll use this ball of yarn. That's because you spent half our budget on yarn. Yarn is very important, okay? All right, here are the rules, Ricky. Roll one. If the ball lands on your side, you lose a point. Can I play with safety, safety belts? Yeah. Why? Maybe the rookie was always bad at sports and always picked last in gym class. Fine, one safety belts. Second time the ball hits your side, you lose a point. Also, safety belts is reset whenever you hit the ball. All right, all right, but that's enough house rules. So let's recap. If the ball hits on the floor of the side twice in a row without you hitting it in between, you lose a point. This is getting confusing. Roll two. No stay on the net. Keep to your side, otherwise you lose a point. You may hit the ball as many times as you want on your side. Your opponent alternates serving and you need two points to win. It's like three rules of one. Try to save time here, alright? Rookie, you start serving. Go! Alright. Okay. <laughs> Have a little trouble there? <laughs> alright. 
<laughs> it's like it's just a, he's like juggling it on his side. I hope I don't do this exact same thing. Okay. Ah. Uh. <laughs> oh no, you're fucked. Point. <laughs> oh, ah. Uh. Missed it. <laughs> I think I found the right serve. This is so dumb! <laughs> you suck! Why are you so bad? <laughs> hey, whose team are you on here? Eh, yeah, perhaps you're right. This really is more of a team game. Oh, okay. How's this? Oh man, I got stuck on this loser. Just shut up and play. Right, I got this. It's fine. Okay, you- okay. <laughs> oh my god, that was a strong turn. <laughs> they brought it into each other. about trouble they have. I'm, I'm attempting to serve it myself, but... It is a little hard to get a score point, but we did one, so we can do it again. Oh. <laughs> How about a rematch? No, Ray. I think we're good. I don't think we need a rematch. Oh man, we lost. Don't worry, you get a consolation prize. Sweet, what is it? Is it snacks? Please let it be snacks. The prize is we get another member! Da da da! What? What a ripoff. Rookie, okay, welcome to the team. Oh, where are my manners? I am Lavender, leader of this here so far unnamed re rebel group. We'll think of a cool name, don't worry. Here you go, Rookie, you've earned it. Slug received their uniform. Oh, hey. Nice. As a convenient opening for each of their eight legs. Huh. Looks like it was made for us. Well,. I don't have eight legs, though. <laughs> we have a whole bunch of these! Someone actually added an extra digit to the order. Numbers are hard! <laughs> Although, I, I suppose it does give us something to strive for. If we had a member for every uniform we got, our past, task would be easy-peasy. As it is, our numbers are small, but our passion is not! We aim to overthrow the Wicked Cat King in the land of the East. So if you have any friends, please spread the word and tell them all about our cause. Yeah, but see, we keep it a secret. I, now I get why our members, numbers never grow. <laughs> Now, let's meet up later. I have some business to attend to. A certain someone needs to be put to sleep if you catch my grift. drift. It's past several of his bedtimes. Well, let's better go look for him. Oh, oh, you... <laughs> yeah, they got a cat. What about us? What do we do? Maybe we can brief the rook on how things work around here. Right, right, I get you. Brief. Uh, okay. Tell me all about it, I guess. Finally, some fresh meat to push around. Yeah, rookie, you better respect your elders do everything we say. Please don't say elders, I'm still young. Rookie, for your first mission, hurry up and get some elbow grease. Yeah, some snacks. We like snacks with our grease. Listen, Rookie, I bet you can find some right down the horrible spike pit right outside your left. Yeah, you should head down there right now. Okay. I, I guess I'll do that. <laughs> that was just the Team Rocket introduction every time Jesse and James arrived. Yeah, earlier, yeah, it was very similar. Let me, uh, there, save. All right, down here. Dead. <laughs> it's fine. So I don't know, but that might have all been optional. This is a kind of complex pit to fall down, I have to admit. Um, that's a lot of guys. Oh my god, that squid right there! Okay, guys, you see that squid right there? You guys, um, the, the little pixel guy. That's an Easter egg right there. You know what that is? I know what that is. I know what that is because I know my history on certain things. You guys, okay, Cave Story, right? You guys know Cave Story. I'm, I'm sure most people know Cave Story. <clears throat> Made by Pixel, right? Well, Pixel made other games, even before Cave Story. One of the games that Pixel made 
was, uh, let's see, what was it? Uh, da, 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 Pixels Works. Here we go. Um, the game I am thinking of is called... Hold on. Yes, Ikachan. If you're curious about it, here's a link. It's a little game where you, you control a squid in an underwater cave system. It's 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 an early version of the Cave Story Engine, actually. So it's it's a, I played it actually a long time ago. It's cute, cute little cute cute little Cave Story s game, except underwater. Anyways, that's an Easter egg because that's literally the sprite from that from that game. Also, uh, speaking of games, where did uh uh. Okay, that's weird. The Wizard and Slug doesn't have a window on the taskbar. That's weird. That's weird. But yeah, that's an Easter egg right there. That's literally the the squiggy plays. That's cute. I have no idea why that's there, but that's cute. So clearly the developer of this game care likes Cave Story. Or Pixel. Or both, probably. Enter? Yeah. Wasn't it released on the Wii? You mean Ikachan was released on the Wii? If it's so, I didn't know that. <clears throat> also, Crab. Hey, there's... She wanted to know what a crab was. Well, now she can... Creature, what brings you to my royal chamber? Just pass through, princess. Charm. Oh, you know who I am? Are you my biggest fan? Judging by your size, you're certainly a contender. Your curse is not corrupt to me, demon. There's not one sin in my heart. Oh, come on now. Not even a teensy tiny one? Really? <clears throat> what about killing me now? Would that count? Perhaps it's time you pop that cherry. Well, okay. I know I cannot kill you, demon, but perhaps... I shall rip your limbs off and have them sit as tribute to our Lord Mother. Oh, Mother. My life and death. Give me the strength to vanquish this foul beast. Hey, wait a minute. Um. Water-dwelling creature. Tough exterior. Sharp pointy things. I know this one! Let's see now. How many legs are that? One, two, three, four, five. Mother. Give me the strength to- Hold on, will ya? Jeez! Oh, come on. It's right there. On the tip of my tongue. If only I had a tongue to begin with. Uh, cra 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 crocodile, right? No? Shoot. Give me the strength. Oh, great mother. Yeah, you know, I don't care. I'm just getting real, starting to real sick of you, looties. Just want to pass through, that's all. Yeah, you keep saying my way, bothering on and on about some curse like you know something. What do you really know? I know you know nothing. Now, stand aside or never stand again, understand? Mother, give me strength. <laughs> Okay, okay. I guess we're gonna, uh, fight? Oh, that's cool. So I can, I can, right, I get, I get you. Uh, is it okay if I touch him? Okay, I get I wasn't sure. <laughs> oh, okay. Up is bad. Gotcha. Oh, I see the eyes. I need to attack the eyes. Well, that's one eye down. That's another eye down. Now what? All oh, the arms? Okay, I gotcha. So he has to make the arms vulnerable, and then I attack him. Oh, that's one arm down. <laughs> You've been disarmed. Okay, um, oh, oh, what the hell? <laughs> oh no, teeny little crabs are being shot. I don't know how to feel about this. Alright. <laughs> He's blind and can't attack with his arms anymore. I've kind of messed him up a bit. <laughs> oh, I see, I gotta shoot around the crabs to actually hit his body. I understand. Ow. Ow. Goodbye. <laughs> I did it. Let's go, kid. All right, where, where to though? Oh, up there? Okay, sure. Sounds good. Off we go. <laughs> uh. Oh, there we are. I was like, I have to jump again. <laughs> Demon, huh? Can you believe that, kid? 
I mean, it's, it's perfect. Wizard man, what was I thinking with that? David sounds much cooler, don't you agree? Right? Are we happy to a villain? I can't tell. Look, kid. I'm not the bad guy here. Do you think I enjoy brawling with those poor souls? I didn't ask for this. Well, that's not entirely true, I suppose. I don't mind a harsh world as long as it's true to itself, unlike these fanatics. Okay, so you're kind of the embodiment of, like, the idea of free will and chaos, then, are you? Interesting. Death is not so bad, kid. Try living forever. Now that's a hassle. Yeah. <laughs> so lighten up, kid. Some fights are worth having. A world devoid of any conflict is not all it's cracked up to be. Believe me, I've lived through it. I've seen what it's like. Look, it's not the easiest thing to explain, but you're smart, kid. You can understand me, I can tell. It's, only, it's honestly mystifies me how mortals, given your short lifespans, can even grasp the simplest of concepts. Don't take it the wrong way, I'm honestly trying to compliment you. It just doesn't make sense to me how you can understand anything at all, really. Stop, just stop talking. Anyway, we'll stay here tonight, so, you, so get some rest, kid. I know you mortals need to rest and stuff, so... So weird. Sorry. I guess to you, I must be the weird one, right? No, not weird. It's just different, right? Yeah, that sounds nicer, doesn't it? No, I'm keeping you up now, aren't I? Don't mind me. I'll keep watching so I don't sleep anyway. And kid, thanks for sticking with me. For trusting me, even without giving you a single reason to. Well, I think it's time I give you a reason. Tomorrow, that is. Now hit the hay, kid. You've earned it. Okay. <laughs> I'll just sleep on the stump. <clears throat> Chaotic neutral? Yeah, I've, I've well... Mom says you're dangerous, but you don't look that tough to me. Your mom is a talker, all right. At least in here, I don't have to endlessly listen to it. So that's a plus, I guess. These shackles, though. Gotta say, not a huge fan. Don't talk about my mother, traitor. I've known your mother for a long time, and believe me, her ego needs no protection for you. I couldn't do that stuff if I tried. What's your name? Shut up, heretic. Look, kid, I'm just making small talk. I'm not here to make small talk with you, traitor. Then, why are you here? <clears throat> I'm... I'm not afraid of you. Boo! Ah! <laughs> Calm down, kid. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Whoa, you okay? I really didn't mean to scare you like that badly. Sorry. I'm not scared. Hey, wait. Where are you going? Don't talk to me. Why not? Just don't. Don't ask stupid questions. What's your name? Shut your mouth. I wish I could, kid. But I don't have a mouth, see? Well, you won't see from there. You need to come closer. <laughs> come on, I will bite. I don't even have any teeth, see? <laughs> I like how the ellipses moving over. Well, now you're just staring. Shut up, I'll stare if I want. I don't mind, at least your eyes are pretty. Ah, stop talking! Hmm. You scare easily, don't you? I'm sorry. Ahem, I'm not scared. Is that a smile? N no. It is, you're smiling. I'm not. Jeez, you're really struggling to keep that one in, aren't you? Better be careful, your face will stick that way. Just sh shut up, traitor. Heretic. You keep using those words. Traitor, heretic. What do they mean to you? Those words. I, I, what about blasphemer? Yeah, that's a good one. Mix it up a little, you know? You see, to me, those words are not insults, but compliments. And while I don't mind the flattery, I'm kind of tied up right now, as you can tell. Not really looking for anything serious at the moment. Sorry, kid. What? It's not a compliment. Hmm. You all right? Your face, it's all red. <laughs> Shut up! Oh, kid? You're still here? What's your name? It... it's... Huh. Oh, uh, excuse me, did she do... she... She went to sleep, seems like. That's... odd. She took a nap. 
Even though she technically didn't need to sleep. That's weird. I'm up. <laughs> Just gonna pounce you. Oh, you're up, huh? You know, the weirdest thing happened to me last night, kid. It was like a memory, but vivid and diffuse at the same time. Never mind, I can't seem to remember much of it anyway. Hmm? A dream? Nah, that can't be right. I'm mor not mortal, remember? I don't eat, I don't sleep, but I certainly don't dream, kid. Although for some reason, I appear to have fa randomly felt like laying on the ground and closing my eyes at some point during the night. Very odd indeed. Well, no point in worrying about that now. We have a mountain to climb. And by that, we're mean, I mean we're literally going to climb a mountain today. Aren't you excited? Yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> my, my, such enthusiasm. I love it. Hmm, what was that? I was supposed to tell you something today? Something important? Yeah, about that. The thing is, well, I lied. <laughs> you do that a lot, I notice. <laughs> Bird Mountain. I'm surprised we're not in Act 2 by now. Message for the PCN. This is Bird Country. Not a bird? Then get out! Fruits are fine. <laughs> Alright. I think that this would be a good stopping point for today's, for the howler on this game. I want a little extra time because, oh, there's an assist mode if you suck at the game. That's nice. Uh, I want a little extra time because, you know, I, I took that little break to get food, so. But honestly, this is, uh, this is pretty dang good. I think this is one, this is going to go on that list of games I want to go back to. Because this has a personality, and I really dig that. 2020 Robin Silkworm Velu. I wonder if... You know, it said a silkworm game near the beginning. I have to wonder, has, has this guy made other things? Guy slash girl, I don't actually know with the name Robin, it's hard to tell. I wonder if, uh, I wonder if they made other things, actually. I wouldn't be surprised. Um, but yeah, The Wizard of the Slug. Very neat game. I, I, I think I want to know where this goes. Because, uh, it's got some very witty writing. I, I really dig a good, a, a good attention to detail on the script. Just, it's so much flavor there, you know? Really good. Fun to read. Fun to voice act, too. Uh, but yeah, I I would say I'd recommend this game. Unless it's, like, ridiculously priced, but even... Like, there's there's definitely some quality here. I, I'd, I'd recommend this game if you enjoy a little platformer with some wittiness and some actual personality. It's hard to find personality in today's market of games. Sometimes... It, sometimes you find games with a good deal of personality bursting out of them, but it's not very common sometimes. Sometimes you... A lot of times you just run into stuff that has kind of generic dialogue and there's not a lot of thought put into the story or even if there is the characters are kind of wooden there's tons of personality here and that's i really dig that but that is the wizard and the slug and uh hopefully i can come back to this for you guys